100 days, what grade would you give President Trump? F. An F? Yeah. Why? An F. Look, he's a man who ran for office promising he was going to be there to help working people. That was going to be his number one, number two, number ten goal, right, all the way through. And so what has he done? Well, first he assembles a team of billionaires and bankers and hands the keys over to them, says to Goldman Sachs, you figure out how to deregulate the economy. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? Then he signs off on all these executive orders. And it's not just the fact that they're executive orders. It's what they actually do. So he signed off on one that makes it easier for government contractors to cheat their employees out of their wages. He signs off on another one that makes it easier for employers who kill or maim their employees to hide that. He makes it easier for investment advisors to cheat retirees. And then, for me, the one that summarizes it all mm. was Trump Care. When he embraces this health care plan and says he's going to go all in, and it had three main features. Part one, <coughs> knock 24 million people off their health care. Well, some coverage. of them might be voluntarily gone. Well, they're gone. going to be gone, knocked yeah. off. Uh, number two, raise costs for a lot of middle class families. And why? For number three, so that you could provide tax cuts for a handful of millionaires and billionaires. I don't know anybody who thought the real problem in health care in America today is that millionaires and billionaires don't have enough tax cuts. He promised to deliver for America's working people, and what he's delivered is a gut punch to America's working people.